Hello everyone, and welcome back to This Week in Mythic Plus. Now this week we have Sanguine, which means when an enemy dies, it'll leave a pool on the ground that heals enemies and damages players. Volcanic, which means that periodically players will spawn a volcano underneath them that will explode and do a lot of damage. And Fortified, which means that non-boss mobs will be doing more damage and have more HP. Now Tanks. You want to keep moving whenever a mob's HP is low so that you don't get hit by Sanguine and you can drop it behind the current pull. Also make sure you watch your feet for Volcanic. You shouldn't be getting any volcanoes spawning underneath you if you do have ranged, but a melee heavy group will have those volcanoes come out in melee. Also this week is a very good week to start chain pulling. As long as your healer's mana is good, you can keep up a very good pace this week. And the last and most important thing is to make sure you play Sanguine away from the main path. Sanguine has been buffed, so the damage on it is high, but it can be completely avoided if you place your Sanguine out of the way or in a corner. DPS, make sure you watch your feet for Volcanic this week, especially since we're pushing to a plus 15 now, that Volcanic can one-shot you. If you are melee, whenever a mob goes down, make sure you move to the side to avoid taking any damage from Sanguine, and cancel any cast if a Volcanic spawns underneath you because you want to avoid that damage. If you take one environmental hit and a volcanic at the same time, that could result in you going down. This week the big focus is trash and trying to get it down, so make sure you use your DPS cooldowns on big trash pulls, and also bring your AoE spec because your tank should be pulling bigger pulls. Healers, this week be ready for burst heals just in case anyone on your team fails to volcanic. You also have to be sure to move out of volcanic yourself, so cancel a cast if it is necessary, and make sure you also watch the sanguine pools. If they are going to be dropped in your way, make sure you move ahead of the tank so that you can avoid damage from these pools. Overall this week, it's pretty easy, it's about a 3 out of 10. All you have to do is keep good movement and placement for Sanguine, make sure to chain pull and keep a good pace going so you can meet that time requirement. And the most important part this week is that tank positioning is key. So make sure you drop your Sanguine puddles off in the corner and not in the main pathway of anything so that no one in your team will take damage or you completely block a corridor that you need to go down. So remember to get out there, push for your plus 15 this week, and this week is a very good week to also log on to all of your alts and push a plus 15 on them as well. So get out there, get your keys done. Thank you guys for watching, and as always, good luck out there.